Hadian kejing mi kejing keno ba kejing keng dam sat kelas dang ban telor bat kala ban pra ha kenu kenu kepor U Chairman ke Managing Director jong ke MEECL U Sanjay Goyal ulah pentip pernah keliang jong ke tenat Meghalaya Energy Corporation Limited kala IT ha ke IIT Guwahati na ke penta ban pet penya ya ke jinglong jingman jong ke jingking dam bat sa iPad ya ke kai pot halor ke jinglap Halor kene gejik pen kre u Sanjay Goyal ulai yatu bana ka liang jong sarkar ka lamang hadu shispa prapo klor tingka ya ka bala bay tingka da ka World Bank bat ban pendap ya ka tega project kan dei hadu usnam arja ar pesan So this has two aspects as honorable minister has also clarified is one part is of, is of the bridge which is which is over the over the dam and uh, the bridge uh, with uh, all these studies which have been done by various agencies uh, is is safe as of now we have done lot of test earlier also in terms of the vibration test and all of course the the pier bearings on which it is resting they have become old so that uh, retrofitting work uh, we are contemplating and we will take it up uh, uh, whenever we are ready with the with all the uh, precautions and with all the machineries which are required to replace them and apart from that as far as the dam is concerned uh, we are uh, Uh, taking up uh, under the dam rehabilitation project of the government of india for which uh, the studies are going on and uh, uh, what kind of uh, interventions are required uh, whether they are leakages which are beyond permissible limits whether they are cracks which are there in the dam or not that studies are going on and uh, there have been direction from the government that we involve iit guwahati iit guwahati is already on board uh, uh, for giving us uh, uh, this uh, uh, study report Uh, as far as the safety of the structure, super structures are concerned, and we have already taken up the matter with IIT Guwahati, and I'm sure that uh, they will do a good work and uh, submit a report to us. And, and uh, at the same time, as I mentioned, the dam rehabilitation project is is entirely different project. It looks into not only the safety of the dam, uh, so many other parameters, uh, the life of the dam. Uh, what kind of uh, interventions are required uh, to increase the life of the dam it's a very scientific approach which the government of india uh, is taking up it's, it's a world aid world bank uh, uh, aided project and uh, i think uh, we should be in a position to take up uh, in a phase manner all the uh, structures which are in the generation part of uh, uh, the state we have already uh, finalized uh, uh, two packages Uh, we have taken up the work uh, of uh, certain categories of work in our leshko uh, uh, also and other dams which are small minor works and uh, the actual the safety of the dam we are now uh, the other four packages are ready uh, package number 226 in fact and five packages for which we have referred uh, for clearance uh, to the to the central uh, uh, pmu which we uh, have uh, in the ministry the moment we get clearance from there we will take up those works also another set of uh, projects is there in the pipeline i have given the deadline of 3 uh, months uh, to my officers to to complete the uh, the uh, requirement as far as the tenders are concerned so our target is that uh, for those uh, the studies should be completed in next 3 months time so that we can take it up again with the government of india to to take up those packages also so idea is that uh, under this project we we take up the the safety and the rehabilitation of all the structures which are related to dam whether it is a gate whether it is the dam as, as such whether the other activities which are allowed under the phase we have been uh, sanctioned around uh, 180 crores out of which uh, uh, we have tendered if i remember correctly uh, around uh, uh, 15 odd crores the other packages which are there in the pipeline for approval uh, would uh, be uh, roughly covering the sanction part the balance the as and when we submit the proposal it gets vetted out it's a thoroughly uh, scientific uh, vetting which is done uh, at various levels and uh, uh, once it is convinced that this is the project which is actually required for uh, for the rehabilitation or the safety part uh, we get the funding and uh, we'll uh, take it up in the days to come this project is to be implemented till 2025 and i'm i'm sure that we have enough time in our hand uh, to take up these activities